What's up, my Grubhub gang? This is your boy Kingfish, aka Big Al, coming at you with another video. What it do? What it do, family? Your boy tired as hell today, guys. Keeping it real with you. Man, I ain't get off till 5:30. I ain't get home till 6 o'clock, fam. Went in at 2 o'clock. 2 o'clock. Welcome back. That's how they do your boy, man. Alright, we got an order. It's 9.30. We got an order at Tropical Smoothie. It's for $7.06. The grind and the hustle don't stop, guys. You know the wife was upset, boy. Say they trying to kill her baby. The wife is protected. She's protected, should I say. She don't play that boy. So I'm putting your resume back out there. <laughs> like woman we just shorthanded right now. You doing my baby like this. <laughs> Use and abuse. Yeah, man. I'll tell you, boy. Whew. We had a few call outs, but we didn't have enough. We just we just don't have enough people, man. That's the bottom line, guys. That's the bottom line, man. Everybody want a job, but nobody want to work when they get it. Ain't that about nothing, God? What's that saying? Everybody want to go to heaven, but no nobody want to die? Everybody want a job, but nobody want to work, man. I'm not understanding this culture, bro. I tell you. See, back in my days in the early 90s, even the early 80s, early 90s, the early 2000, nah, no 2000, but the 80s and 90 babies, man, they work. These 2000 babies, man, oh my gracious, man. Soon you walk in the door, what time we getting off? Damn, can you pick up a case first? Like, gee, be Christmas. It's another long night, gee, be Christmas. Yes, because you already defeated. I keep telling these youngsters, man, they defeat themselves as soon as they walk in the door. They worry about the wrong thing. They don't worry about pulling together and getting out of there. They worry about how long it's going to be, how many hours. Psychologically, they already gone. They done. That's like a fight. That's like a fighter going up against Mike. That's how Mike Tyson used to beat all the fighters, guys. He used to look them in their eyes. As soon as they look away, he smiled, he know he got it. Feel me? He sensed that scared, that, that, that. All he gotta do is say, okay, I don't even have to knock this guy out. All I gotta do is leave, hit him hard one good time. And I got him, because his mind is already gone. That's why I try to tell these young kids that I work with. Your mind is already gone, so you walk in the door. Because you worry about the wrong thing. You're not going to work hard when you're worrying about something. Trust me, I know. I said again, you're not going to work hard when you're worrying about something. When you come to work to work, guys, you're going to work. When you come to work ready to go home, you're not going to get no work done. I don't care how much you try to motivate yourself or try to push yourself, you're not gonna get it done. Your mind is already defeated. Oh, I had to get that off my chest, man. First thing they said, well, I can outwork you. You couldn't outwork me if I had no arms. <laughs> God, if they would let me just show these women, I mean, women, show these workers how 
how a real man do it. How to work smart and not hard. But they don't allow you to do that. I will work circles around them. I would beat them with my mind. Not with my physique or my, my physical. I'm sorry fam, I just had to get that off my chest. I know some of my guys watch the video, so I just want to send that subliminal message out there. They already defeated before they come to work. You change your mind state. Your mind control your body. Your mind want to tell your body you tired. I don't let my mind control my body. I let my body control my mind. When it comes to my work ethic. And I told him, I said, I always tell him, look at the positive side, guys. You making all the money you can get want to get right now. What you do with it is a different story. But you getting paid. That's what I'm saying, guys. They get paid to be there this late. I don't. I'm salary. I don't get paid for 14, 15 hours. You feel me? So when they come to me and say, Mr. Al, I work 15 hours. I don't give a damn, man. You got paid for them 15 hours. I didn't. I lose money as long as I be there. <laughs> And you know what the positive side of this is? I have a job. That's the positive side. That's it. So for every negative I find it, every time I get down on myself, I find that positive and that negative. And I say, okay, I gotta remember. <laughs> I signed up for this. This is my job. That's the positive side. That's how you turn the negative into a positive, guys. Now, as as a, if I was an employee, you know what I'd do? For those that were slacking last night, that wasn't I know that wasn't pulling their half, I will I will call them out today. I'm like, look, man, we worked 15, 16 hours yesterday because you you ain't do your half, your part. We're a team. You do your half, we get out of here. My team stepped it up, man. Cause I don't let them think about the negative. I always push them for that positive. My number one selector quit on me because he couldn't find the negative, the positive in the negative. And that because you're good at what you do don't mean you get to carry the whole job on your shoulder. This young man put so much pressure on himself, he couldn't take it. He quit. You can't do that, guys. I just want to make sure I was going to the right place. I ain't cut my GPS on. <laughs> oh, yeah. After I get this order, guys, I'm getting that coffee, man. I am not going to the one on Fowler. Not doing it. I just got to teach somebody how to love my coffee like Tower did. If I could do that, guys, I'm in there. I had to bend a little bit, guys, so I appreciate you listening to me, family. You are my therapy, too. Ooh, I got to get gas. Oh, Lord. I'm really going to be venting if I don't get no gas. Shut up. Okay, so let me go get this. Damn. Hey, getting this smooth today. day.
Oh, dang, man, I'm sorry. I know I'm tired, guys. I kept I kept it going all that time. I apologize, guys. <laughs> oh, my God. I know I'm tired, guys. I normally don't let y'all sit in the dark. I'm truly sorry, guys. Let me see how much gas I got. Hey, love. Uh-uh, I gotta order some tropical smoothies. Okay. You sure? Alright. Oh, hell no. I ain't stuck no ducks today. Alright. Alright, love you. Bye-bye. Hey, she wanna go to the store and get some bread for the duck. I ain't stuck them damn ducks today, man. Them ducks can go to hell. <laughs> I mean that. I ain't stuck no ducks today, man. Let's take East Fowler Avenue, Tampa, and North 15th Street University. In 500 feet, turn right on East Fowler Avenue. <laughs> Call me talking about the duck needs some food. <laughs> One more day. One more day. <laughs> she getting up out of here. Yes, sir, guy. But I hope I help somebody out there on my bent. Guys, when it comes to a job, you can't speak negative stuff. You can't come and say, oh, we're gonna be here all night long. Cause you gonna be there all night long. <laughs> you gotta come in there with a positive attitude, man. Oh man, we're gonna knock this stuff out. We're gonna get out of here, bam. That way, you're gonna do your part. I shut them up. I be like, shut, 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 shut. I'm about to hear that mess. I never come out of the house saying I ain't making no money today. I always come out saying I'm gonna make a hundred dollars. I don't always make a hundred dollars, but I'm, I have a positive attitude. You know what I mean? That's gonna help me get that money. In 2.5 miles, turn right on North 15th Street. That's for sure. Somebody got them three. Um, they got three smoothies early this morning. I guess that's gonna be breakfast. Big Rick taking all my money. Hey right, man, Big Rick did good yesterday, man. Over a hundred. I ain't do no orders on Tuesday. I mean Sunday. I just couldn't do it, guys. My whole body hurt. I got beat to work back at three o'clock. Boss man want to have a meeting. I'm keeping it real today. I can't keep doing this. <laughs> That's, uh, as the younger say, keeping it 100, I'm keeping it 2,000. On the favela, my nephew. Oh, I'm not supposed to say that word no more. Headlight camera reported ahead. Carl, you got to let me know what you did, man. I can't claim victory if you don't let me know what you did, man. I finished with 468, man. I hope everybody's doing well. I hope I said that. Pray for my girl, MG. She haven't been back on yet. Pray that her situation or whatever she's going through get better. Pray for my big buddy Tim, my light-skinned brother. Hope you're doing well, man. Hope chemo is going good for you. You know. Woo. 
Miss Weeks, I ain't talked to you in a while. I hope your mom is doing good. I found me an all night, a 24 hour McDonald's, man. I was so happy when I got out this morning, I was able to go get breakfast. I said, what time y'all open? He said, we 24 hours. I was like, that's all I need to know, dog. All I need to know. I don't like to eat and then go to sleep. But sometimes, God, I be so hungry. I can stop and get something. I ain't gonna get nothing heavy. I get something light. Dang, they took me out of Tampa, brought me to North Tampa. What a hell of a way to start my morning. Now that tell me they saw the drivers in, in North Tampa. It's funny guys, when I cut my app on, where I live at, it's, it's never no bonuses. Because it's a lot of people that dash there. But everywhere else it'll be $3, $1, $2. But temperatures don't never have no bonus. See everybody trying to get that eight, 900. Shout out to my man who hit 600 this week. I forgot your name. I don't know if you was a man or a woman, but shout out to the person that hit 600. Wow. That's sending one hell of a message. I see a guy, um, you know, he got his cup out. He asked for money, but he don't have no small cup. He got an extra, extra large cup. <laughs> That's how you do it, God. <laughs> if I'm going to ask for something, I'm bringing out a big cup. Right on East 127th Avenue. You got one of them pimp cups. <laughs> That's it. Uh, one of them gas station cups. So every time you, you run out of something, if you need something to drink, you just go to the gas station and get a refill. You got to be smart. Not dumb. I can tell you this much, guys. I know I'm tired because I feel goofy and Turn right on East 127th all right, Avenue. All right, all, right. all right, guys. If you don't know what the day is, the day is keeping it real Monday. You're not going to be disrespectful to nobody, but you're going to keep it real. Feet. Turn right on if somebody, Terrace something Terrace is bothering you, today is the day that you let them know it's bothering you. Alright man, get the hell out of the way. Just keeping it real. You will get hit. Tell them, Trini. Turn right on If you ain't the police, if you ain't the crossing guard, if you are not a baby or a kid or an elder, in you can get feet, hit. You'll arrive at 12503 Tinsley Terrace Drive. 12503. I don't know how many times I've been back here. This is the neighborhood nobody want to come to. Off Tinsley Drive. 503. When it comes to money, man. You've I arrived at your destination. I ain't scared of going. No neighborhood, man. People sense fear. Just remember, every neighborhood is always a Mookie, a Black, a Joe, and a John. <laughs> hey, man, you seen Black Joe? <laughs> nah, man. If you see him, tell me his cousin looking for him. <laughs> I don't even know who that is. 
I will pause this time, guys. I ain't trying to burn up my video, guys. You know I like talking to you guys. I'll be right back. I'm back, guys. OG tried to get me. OG said, boss man, you going north? I said, no, I'm going south. He said, okay, I'm going that way. I said, not today you ain't. <laughs> He's like, you can't give me a ride to the bus stop? I'm like, no, sir. I said, I have a no stranger policy. He said, my name is Mike, man. I said, Mike, <laughs> I don't know you, Mike. <laughs> I said, I'm sorry, Mike. I don't ride strangers, man. He was like, yeah, man, yeah, man. You must be from down south, man. Yes, I am. Because down south, man, we don't ride strangers, man. Not that, Mike. Can't trust everybody you meet, guy. I'm working. Plus, I told him, you know, I'm working, Mike. I don't ride people while I'm working. That's all you had to say, man. I ain't had to say nothing, Mike. <laughs> I'm giving you this conversation because you opened the door. You're going to ask me, play, you going north? Like, nah, man, I'm going south. Oh, that's the way I'm going. <laughs> yes, sir, guys. I'm a nice guy, guys. But I don't deal with fast talkers, man. You're not getting in here messing around and rob me. Oh, oh no. <laughs> yes, uh, spider senses went up real quick. <laughs> but I love my hood, man. I love my hood, man. It's funny as hell. Yeah, Rick is uh, 127th Street, Tinsley. Teens the apartment, man. These people's off the chain back here, guys. Right behind the mall, man. Why all the bad neighborhoods is by a mall, behind the mall, right across the street from four or five banks, two Amscot, and then wonder why they always having problems. But you put a, you put these people in these low income houses, and you put all these, these um, temptations in front of them. Then you take 12 hours to come to the neighborhood. By the time the car comes in this neighborhood, you can rob a bank, spend the money, go buy a car, come back, and then get locked up. Did I clear you out? That nah, ain't even clear him out. Mike messed me up. Oh boy, what a morning, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna go get my coffee, guys. I got an order done, I'm happy. I'm gonna go get my coffee. What's up, man? And uh, I'm taking it in. <laughs> I'm gonna lay in bed and sip my coffee. I'm going back to bed, guys. Yes, sir. Uh, I got a bacon, egg, and cheese um, biscuit waiting on me at home. I'm trying to get to that. I think it's about, it's supposed to get in the 80s today, so today gonna be a good day in Tampa, guys. Today gonna be a nice day in Tampa. Wow. Oh, gas. Let me go get gas, guys. I'm talking to y'all. I'm messing around. Run out of gas. My Dunkin' Donut that way. <laughs> one of one of the girls that work at Dunkin' Donut work at um, Tropical Smooth. She said, "You remember me?" I said, "Yeah, I remember all that attitude." She said, "I don't have no attitude." I said, "You forgot I was there when you showed off one day." She said, "Oh." oh. We was talking about Tyler. She worked with Tyler. She said, yeah, he famous for taking people out the, 
the schedule. I had to cuss him out. <laughs> I said, did he put you back on the schedule? He said, yep. So, Tal, you need to cuss him out. <laughs> so, Tal, don't play with my money. This is a part-time job. I signed up for three days, not two. Okay, there go my Dunkin' Donut. Yeah, I'm on Dunkin' Donut. I'm on Fowler, but I'm, I'm on North, North Tampa. I'm going to give them a try. I mean that, man. And the funny thing is, guys, it's like six or seven Dunkin' Donuts all in one area. So I ain't hurting. You know, I don't have to go to that Dunkin' Donut. Uh-oh, policeman is on the premises. Uh, what they doing in here? All right, guys, I'll be right back. All right, fam, I'm back. Uh-oh. Hot damn, got an order. Where we going at? Some sound shot. Oh man, Billy really gotta take me all the way up there. Damn. I go all the way close to work. Alright, I'm gonna get this money. What? Alright, I should money doing lunch. This Monday, Thursday, tap the bill. Alright, we gotta get some gas, guys. Let's take I-275 South out. and West Hillsboro Avenue, Tampa. In 300 feet, turn right, then turn right. Shut up! I'm already mad I got to go there. You gonna rub it in. See how she do? She know, she sensed that I'm upset that I gotta go all the way to Hillsboro. I don't have to go, but I'm gonna get this money, guys. I'm out here to make money. I ain't out here to turn down orders. You know what I mean? I ain't trying to piss my people that turn down orders off, but turn I don't right. know. You know, I pick and choose when I turn down an order, and this is not an order I want to turn down. I better get some gas, I know that much. What time I got to be there? 10.38? Oh, yeah. Coffee's pretty good. Can't complain. Alright, let me stop up here and get some gas, guys. In 700 feet. Shut up! Turn left on North 22nd Street. Then turn left. Turn left on North 22nd Street. Then turn left on East Fowler Avenue. See, they got me working off Tampa. This is on North Tampa side. Alright, family, I'll be right back. Alright, family, I'm back. That gas station like Walmart, man. Got everything in it. Yep, it got everything in it. When I say everything, it got electronics, it got clothes, it got food. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. I know it's a top of it. I don't care if Tommy orders ready, I ain't there yet. Submit so, test, let me know the order ready. I don't care, I gotta get gas. Won't make it there. All right, family, I appreciate y'all letting me vent this morning. You know, don't forget the day is keeping it real Monday. I reached that critical time in my moment. I'm in mean, my video where I got to say goodbye. <coughs> Trust and believe, guys. As soon as I do this order, if I make it home, I'm going back to bed, guys. But I had to make this video, guys, and I wanted to, uh, you know, get up and dash this morning. Big Rick just sent me a text. See what he said. Coming to a light, MG. Poaching today. <laughs> Hell yeah, Rick, I'm poaching. Ain't that something, guys? It's going on a flying. 
Now, that means I'm poaching today. You damn right I'm poaching. All right, family, this is your boy, Kingfish, a.k.a. Big Owl. I'm out, guys. If you're dashing, keep dashing. If you're grubbing, keep grubbing. If you're not dashing, you're not grubbing, you better get yourself some dashing grub, man. Guys, pray that I be able to go back to sleep. Coffee do not keep me up, guys. I just love the taste. Peace. <laughs>